Green Building and Design Magazine is a national publication really focusing on sustainable solutions and sustainable leadership. I started GB&D in 2009 and I was coming out of the construction industry, working in media, and realizing that all of the interesting, kind of troublemaking people worked in sustainability. And I didn't know anything about sustainability, but what I learned is there's a common thread that people that work for the environment, that work in sustainability, want to do better. They're not happy with how things are just as is. They're constantly challenging, they're always pushing, they're always that person in their company that's on to the next thing. A third of global businesses have no women at all in senior management, and I think that we need to change that, and I think that that is really the mission of WSLA, is to really recognize the women that are doing amazing things in their field. As Laura and I continued to work in sustainability and evolving GB&D, we were continually being inspired by women that were facing great challenges and making great progress in the built environment, but getting very little recognition for it. And so four years ago, we decided to create the Women in Sustainability Leadership Award. Ultimately, it is our responsibility to start creating the leaders that we need and the leaders that we want to see. And what better way to do that than recognize some of the amazing women that, that are already making accomplishments and strides in sustainability. But there's also this part of the award where we look for bravery, and I think that's part of what really gets to us as judges, is seeing how long some of these women have stayed truly focused and laser committed to their goals, to their achievements, regardless of the opposition, regardless of those in trend, if they were receiving recognition, if they were making big money. All of these women had to demonstrate the work that they've done in sustainability. They had to demonstrate the lasting change and impact that they've had in sustainability. They had to demonstrate the courage and bravery that they've had to show. In addition to that, they've really had to showcase what type of mentorship initiatives that they've taken. When we started the award, we quickly realized how important this award was and how powerful it was. And our first award reception was so moving. It was seeing these powerful executives feel like they were truly being honored amongst their peers. Seeing these women year after year come up on stage and, and receive their award is, is inspirational for me. I would say these women are pretty badass. Tonight, GB&D is honored to recognize 10 of the most powerful women working in sustainability. And we want to give a special thanks to our sponsor, Metrofloor, and our partner, USGPC, who has helped make this award possible. Metrofloor has been an amazing sponsor and just supporter of the WSLA Awards. Rochelle Routman, their CSO, has been the alumni chair. It was a really hard judging process this year, but we came out with 10 unbelievable women. The Women in Sustainability Leadership Awards are important because they give us the opportunity to honor and recognize some of the incredible women doing amazing things. From architecture to consulting to engineering to nonprofits to corporate executives, we have a wide range of women all doing very powerful work in their fields. Ladies and gentlemen, Green Building and Design welcomes you to the 2017 Women in Sustainability Leadership Awards. The 2017 Women in Sustainability Leadership Award judges include Chris Howe and Laura Heidenreich, Green Building and Design, Rochelle Routman, Metrofloor Corporation, Halstead International, Kimberly Lewis, U.S. Green Building Council, Amanda Sturgeon, International Living Future Institute. The 2017 Women in Sustainability Leadership Award winners include Dr. Doigu Erten, Turkey Co., Deb Frodel, GE Ecoimagination, Alana Juda, FX Fowley Architects, Sandra Leibowitz, Sustainable Design Consulting, Catherine Luthen, Luthen Associates, Susan Rocheford, Legrand North America, Lynn Simon, Thornton Tomasetti, Jillian Tadoon, Banyan Water, Verge Teme, Verge Teme Architecture, Wendy Vittori, HPD Collaborative. Please join GB&D in congratulating the 2017 Women in Sustainability Leadership Award winners.